Scott and I have all the wall lines snapped for this particular building. So the next step is to get down our wall plates. There's two types of wall. There's a through wall and there's a butt wall. And the through walls run all the way through. And the next wall we put down is going to butt to that one. So all of the walls that run parallel with that outside wall are going to be through walls. The walls that run at perpendicular to the outside walls are going to be butt walls. And that way, when we get, get around to framing, the way we lay our walls back, it makes it easier. And we put down two plates on every line, all through the building. Put down the bottom plate and the top plate for each wall. So first of all, what we do is we scatter all the plates. And we tack these plates down with eight penny nails so they'll stay in place because we got to pull them back up in order to frame the walls. So we can start down to this end. And we lay this first plate right on the line. First thing we notice, we got plumbing here. So we got to cut out for that plumbing. Yeah. Important thing to remember here, this is an intersecting wall coming in right here. So your top plate has to break at least four foot away from that, that intersecting wall. Here we got about five feet, so we're good to go. But say like our top plate hit here, we'd have to break it back. So can we lay this one on top of it? Yep. That's our bottom plate, tacked down. And this is our top plate. Okay, we have to hold these plates in place so we get all the marks on them before we start framing. So we tack this bottom plate down to the floor with eight penny nails. Get the nail. Now where it's important, out here there's no intersecting walls. So you don't have to be right on the line. Where you have to be after is right here. Where you got an intersecting wall, you want to make sure that wall is right on the line. Because we're going to butt this wall to it. Here's the intersecting wall right here. Don't put a nail right there. Step back about six inches. That way it won't be in the, in the way of a, a stud. Just stick an eight-penny nail there. This one goes on. And it, it tacks down with eight-penny nails. And again, at that intersecting wall, it's important to keep everything lined up. I'm so happy to see somebody still working on the rigging. I love those rigs. <laughs> I would do this to mark this final cut. Like that. Okay. And then cut away and then you I would do it by Okay. okay. So what are you looking for when you go how do you square up your saw? You go ahead and cut that and then I'll put the double top on. Okay. This is the double top plate. On the framing jobs I worked on, nobody even had a square. Never I like it. One. Yeah. <laughs> Never used one. So it's, it's simple. You know how to do this. 
you can you can first of all you can eyeball it with the cuttings. Yep. And as long as this round edge here of this table on this skull is parallel with the edge of your board, that's square. So all you gotta do is make your cut. And if it's off a bit, knife goes on. So we get a nail in here to hold that right on the mark. We got this outside wall plated. And now we're going to uh, start with some other walls that we have laid out. Larry, for the interior walls, would you keep the same idea? Yeah. There you go. This is another through wall. Parallel with that outside through wall. We don't want to tack it in place because that's going to be taller. We'd have to chop both plates, wouldn't we? Given the height of that pipe. Your bottom plate, don't you have to cut your bottom? Well, yeah, cut the bottom plate, but then we'd have to cut the top plate no, too. No, to... no, we'll just land alongside. Yeah. So we're going to run in this duck wall. Right. So we got to cut. We have to cut it on the plumbing. This plate here, we leave it laying just like that, right there, and we can mark our layout on it. Now we've got this two to six wall. You're good at this, Chuck. You're a lot better than me. <laughs> I'm a little more sloppy than that. <laughs> I'll give it time. Yeah. And maybe I'll improve. <laughs> I keep adding long enough. <laughs> 